Hi, today I'll show you how to connect an external synth to your deluge and sequence its parameters via MIDI CC from your deluge. I have to turn on monitoring on the deluge. I hold a pad and press the select knob to make an audio clip. I hold the learn button and press the same pad. I turn the select knob to stir with the dot. This means monitoring is on and now I can hear it. I select a wavetable synth on the organelle. I want to be able to sequence it from the deluge, so I set up a MIDI track. Good, it's working. I turn up the velocity on this one note because it's a bit quiet. I do this by holding a pad and turning the upper left knob. Whatever I dial in is the new default velocity. The notes I'm entering now, they're all going to have that same velocity now. Now I can adjust the sound turning the knobs on the organelle. But I want to be able to sequence this on the deluge as well. For this I have to assign the right MIDI CC numbers to the gold knobs. CC22, for example, is the mod width. I press and hold the gold knob to assign a MIDI CC number. I then turn the select knob to choose the right number. I'm gonna do this for three of the four knobs. The first knob is the synth type, and I don't want to automate that, but I could if I wanted to. For the organelle, the CC numbers for the four parameters are 21, 22, 23, and 24. This was the wavetable position, and the last one is the release time. Now I can super easily assign values of these parameters to each node. The very same way I do it with the deluge's own synth. I just hold down the pad of a node and adjust the parameter. This works pretty much the same with any external synth. It's easy to get some crazy sounds with this. Of course, I can also simply record automation. I simply hit the record button and move the knob. The movement is now recorded into the sequence. It also overrides whatever adjustments I make on the organelle itself. Deleting automation is easy too. You just hold shift and press the gold knob. As you can see, the orange light doesn't jump around anymore. If I dial in a new value now, it stays there. Usually each parameter of a synth has its dedicated CC number. With the organelle, that's a bit different. The CC numbers are assigned to the knobs instead of the parameters. And the functions of the knobs are different from patch to patch. Here I changed into the effects menu of the patch. Now the same automation as before is affecting the delay parameters and not the wavetable anymore. To change the delay and keep my original automation, I have to dial in the delay parameters while the sequence isn't running. And then navigate back to the wavetable menu. Well, that's all I've got for you today. I hope you found this useful and thank you very much for watching.